What's good in the hood? Um, I want to talk today about something that is very interesting that happens to me quite frequently. People say, hey, Shanae, you know, they get to know me. You know, you're like an Oreo. I'm like, Oreo? What's she talking about? I don't even eat those. She's like, Oreo, you're like black on the outside and white on the inside. I'm like, wait, hold up. When I was in middle school, you hear a lot of crazy things. You know, you hear the show, kids say the darndest things. Yeah, kids really do say the darndest things. And you know, besides being called, you know, a beanstalk or called Big Bird, people call me an Oreo. And I was like, what? Just because I talk a certain way or act a certain way. Being called an Oreo, obviously, is not nice. Um, it's not something you wanna hear. It's not something that bothered me, but I think it's something that needs to be addressed. You know, you, the USA is a melting pot. It, so many people from different cultures come, and with that is the assumption that you become more like the mainstream, the popular, the main culture. And for me, I guess that's, you're acting white, that's why you're considered an Oreo. Um, but I don't know, I, in a way, I take anything that is shade or hurt, and I turn it against the person who says it, and say, you know what, I'm just surprising you. I'm surprising you with how good I'm doing academically. I'm surprising you with, you know, how I conduct myself. I think we are who we are. I identify with being American and African, African American, all of that, black, all of the above. So labels don't really help us. I think they hurt us. And I can understand why someone would say, oh, you're, you're like not the usual person that I associate with a certain culture, or you don't act that way. And I'm just like, okay, well, this conversation probably isn't helping me do my work right now, so. Let's just keep on stepping. A funny thing is like, people are like, oh, you're from Texas? I didn't even hear texting in your voice. I was like, I can turn on the draw real quick if I want to. So um, I think we are way more than what meets the eye as you know, individuals, uh, individuals in this world. And before we start calling people names or labeling them or confining them based on what they look like or how tall they are, or, you know, what, what they, um, their interests are, we should get to know that person. All right, you heard. The funny word, Oreo, not the snack, what people used to call me. Um, if you've been called that and you feel a certain way, I wanna know what you think. Obviously my experience, you know, I use my tough skin to just let it roll off my shoulder. I, don't, I ain't got time for that. That's what she was saying, I ain't got time for that. But if you, if you have something that you wanna share, make sure you let me know. Um, message, tweet, comment. Let me know what you feel about this issue because it is a very important issue and everyone has an equal voice.